Okay guys, we'll just do, um, just kind of do something on the driver. Okay, now, nothing changes. Nothing changes from the, from the irons to the driver. Everything's exactly the same. And the reason it's exactly the same for me is because my arms are in the same place. If I have a, if I've got a five iron, and I set it up to the ball here, there here's my arms, and that's where I am here. So I'm going to start it exactly the same. The push away is going to be the same. All the balance factors are going to be the same. See where that was there? When I've got the driver, the arms in the same place. See that? I don't vary that, guys. Okay, I grip the club down a little bit. But I've got to tell you, since I've been dripping, gripping the club down, yeah, I just get, I've got more distance and, and, and more accuracy. I've always been a pretty good driver of the golf ball, straight one. But now it's just, it's just crazy. So, yeah, you can't have an iron swing and a driver swing with channel locks. You just can't have that. So here we are all the time. It's here. See, that club's almost resting on my body. Here, guys, look. It's not there. It's here, look. And that's the big, I think that's probably the big difference for the people who are struggling with the driver. That's probably the big difference. You need to get here. See that? Because it feels like an iron swing. I don't want my driver swing to feel like something else. Because that's that's just going to be a differential of feel. I mean, that's elementary, dear Watson. But you know, invariably, with in a conventional golf swing, we get so much of a difference in in a driver swing because we're usually here to an iron swing where we're here. Now the balance factors are enormous, and the control of those balance factors. Uh, are enormously difficult. So, guys, very, very important to to adopt exactly the same process with the driver here. I don't know if you can see that ball flight, but I mean, it, it's always the same. It's always just dead straight. Just never gets away. Well, even even if it's not dead straight, I mean, I usually always play with a little draw. Um, but um, for all intents and purposes, it's the same draw, same amount of draw. And we've got a strong right to left wind coming across here right now. Uh, so at the worst, I'm going to get guys a little push. But I keep saying, I ain't never getting one going this way. It just doesn't go that way. It will not go over here. It can't go over here. And, and that's an amazing facility. Just a sensational facility. It's just the same. Front on. <clears throat> yep. Straight back into that that knockdown headwind. Ball just goes a little draw. And these are dead cold golf swings, guys. And he shots. I've hit of the ones you've seen. Yeah, so the secret, guys, is you never change the protocol. Never ever change the protocol ever.
Yeah, so the driver, I find the driver easy because uh, the ball's teed up. Uh, and the ball just gets in the way. I'm not trying to put the club on it. Just gets in the way. All right, full swing. Trying to get dead onto the camera. That's as good as it gets right there. Whew. Now it's a little abbreviated golf swing. And, uh, but it's very, very economical. And it's incredibly accurate. And it's, it's got plenty of power. I'm not lacking any power. None. And you're just always going to get the same flight with the driver. Imagine standing on every tee and thinking it can never go over here. At worst it can just push a little bit if the face is open a bit. So whatever's on the left has been a problem or a nemesis in the past, it's not there. It's ruled out. Just ruled out. I think one slightly different angle because they're just uh, going up towards the, the OB fence and there's a few cows up there. So I'll hit slightly different angle. perfect and the amazing thing is guys you look up and and as soon as you look up you you instinctively look straight because you know the ball's going to be there and, and you, this ball ends up being between your two eyes you just do that it's an amazing feeling amazing feeling Yeah, so the driver, guys, is no different to uh, no different to the uh, to the irons. Exactly the same. Just hit a couple down here and just see. I just want to try a couple of different angles with the camera and just see if we can get some work out some ball flight today. I don't know what that's like. Very hard to tell. Very hard to tell. I look at the camera here and I think, yeah, that's right. And I go home and, and all my wide angle is on this side. It's not on that side. It's just, it's amazing. Slightly different angle, maybe, maybe that's better. It's five on guys. Let's try a slightly different angle again. trying to knock them down a little bit because if you hit them up in the air you can't see the ball fly. The wind's coming across here so don't want to blow it up in the air too much. Now this is a long way right of the camera. I might set up here but I'll hit over here. This will be interesting. Um, yeah, I'll just have a look at this for a camera angle. I'll hit over here. I don't know what that's like. Just a few different angles, guys. I just want to do this for myself to just work out and I'll remember where I hit them. I'll hit this one a long way, right? Because maybe that's the angle. I don't know. The problem might go out of sight. But it might be the angle. I 
Now if that picks that up on the camera I'll be amazed because that's 40 yards right of where the camera looks like it's aiming. Now that's straight down the gun barrel in terms of the camera. Just push that out to the right. Yeah, I just want to, I'm just trying to look for some angles guys, that's all. And if I can hit it low and see the angle, I'll know when I go home and, and have a look. Now I'll hit one here what I think is is dead straight in front of the camera. You know, probably this will be interesting because it probably won't be. That's what I think is dead straight in front of the camera. Okay guys, just wanted to do a little bit there, but that little bit on the driver, I hope that uh, I hope that it uh, helped you out.